favourite memory of Pam and Dirk is the seafood festival when I came over to stay with you a few years back. Um, and the thing that I've learnt from you both is how important family is coming over and seeing your tight-knit family. Congratulations and happy anniversary. Love from me, mum and granddad. Bye. Hey Pam and Dick, happy anniversary, 60 years. That's awesome. I just wanna let you know how much I love you both, how much you've meant to me and JP all these years. You are our family. You're like my parents. Well, you know you are. And thank you for making me part of your family. Hope you have another 60. I love you both. And it's just a pleasure to be, know that you guys are in my life. Thank you. And I love you. Happy anniversary, Dick and Pam. Eddie and I would like to wish you many, many more blessed years together. And thank you for all the years that we've been friends and bowling and having so much fun together. We miss you guys dearly. So enjoy and here's to many more. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary, Pam, Rich. At 60 years, you're newlyweds. Hey, Richard and Pam, congratulations. I wish we were there. Happy anniversary. Oh, hello. With your, with the laughter part, I thought I would tell you two, one of two things. I was going to recite, recite, it's a good ship Venus, or I was going to tell the hump joke. I've decided on the hump joke because I'm sure there's kids nearby. And if anyone wants to hear the good ship Venus, wait till my mom has a few drinks and I'm sure she'll recite it to me. But anyways, here's the hump joke. There was t these two Englishmen in a pub. One had a hump back. One had a good leg. The guy with the humpback goes, Hello, mate. He says, I think I'll just go on the shortcut on the way home. He goes, Through the cemetery, you know. It's a shortcut. The guy with the good legs, I ain't going through the cemetery. It was too scary for me. The guy with the humpback said, I am. Well, later on, after drinking, he went through the, he went through the cemetery. And he came across his life in the distance. His life just getting closer and closer. He got right upon him, right by him. It scared him. The voice said, What's that on your back? I said, It's a up. The voice reached over and said, Let me have it. Pull it up here. Well, off, off I went in. The next morning I looked in the mirror and it was true. My hump was gone. He goes, I'm going back to this pub tonight and celebrate. So back he went to the pub. And then when he walked in, there was a guy with a wooden leg. And the guy with the wooden leg goes, Hey mate, there's something different about you, isn't there? He goes, yeah, me up's gone. He goes, what happened to it? He goes, well, last night on the way home, he says, I walked through the cemetery, remember? He goes, and I saw this bright light, and it got closer and closer, and right upon me, the boy said, what's that on your back? And I said, it's a hump, and it pulled it off my back. Well, the guy with the wooden leg said, I'm going through the cemetery tonight. So off he went there. And he come across that light as he was walking through the cemetery. And it was in the distance and he got closer and closer and it got right upon him and he was all excited and the voice says, what's that? And he goes, it's a wooden leg. And the voice goes, you want a hump? Anyways, love you, congratulations on 60 years. Thank you, bye bye. Hey mom and dad, happy anniversary, the big 60. That must be mean. I'm going to be 60 soon. We just wanted to say we love you. Sherry's got something to say too. She's frozen. Frozen on camera. I am. Well, that's not going to work. First, we and Pam and Uncle Richard. My favorite memories are any time that the whole family gets together to celebrate at your house. And you guys have taught me that family always comes first. I love you and I miss you and I hope to see you soon. Happy 60th anniversary, Gaga and Papa. Thank you for teaching us all the importance of family and what a loving marriage looks like. We couldn't have asked for better role models. We love you. Happy 60th anniversary. We miss you and we love you. 
And my favorite memory of all of us is uh, our times at the dinner table with all the family being together. And my favorite memories, I have too many of them, but um, they're all cherished and I just wish for many more. Happy anniversary, Dick and Pam. 60 years? Six zero. That's a long time. But anybody that's been around you can tell how much you love each other. You make that 60 years seem like nothing because you're laughing and you're really enjoying your lives together. I can tell you as your nephew, you've been a shining example of what it means to love. And speaking for this part of the Guest Ford family, we want you to know how much we love you and how much we thank you so much for modeling such beautiful love for each other. Here is to 60 years strong. Happy 60th. We love you so much. Here's to 60 more. For the two of the most inspirational people in my life, I could not find the words to say, but instead I found a poem, The Grandparents' Creed. For love lavished beyond all measure, for happy hours always to treasure, for bounteous meals at holiday season, for a wealth of memories beyond all reason, for gifts of love fashioned with care, for secrets shared on occasions rare, for quality of life that examples impart, I love my grandparents with all my heart. Happiest 60th anniversary. 60 years ago, the average cost of a new home was $12,400. The average yearly wage, $5,000. Cost of a gallon of gas, 25 cents. The average cost of a new car, $2,200. And you could go to the movies for $1. But for 60 years of marriage, priceless. Congratulations on 60 years. Love you. Happy 60th anniversary. Who could ever have imagined what a little dab of pagan perfume behind each ear would turn into. My wish for you is many more years of good doings. Happy 60th wedding anniversary, Pam and Dick. I love you both very much. I gotta go on Papa. I'd like to wish a happy 60th anniversary to my great uh, grandparents. And uh, thank you and I love you guys. And I would like to wish you a happy 60th anniversary as well. And thanks for all the good cooking and that warm swimming pool. So when we think of you guys, the two of you and all that you mean to us. It doesn't seem right to say that only you are wonderful grandparents, but that you are wonderful friends as well. We are here to celebrate your 60 years of marriage, 720 months of hugs, 3,130 weeks of laughter, 21,915 days of patience, and most importantly, 525,950 hours of love. Hearts that love so deeply as yours never grow old. One by one, each year flew by since you both said I do. It has been 60 years of memories shared by the two of you. From big events and holidays to simple daily pleasures, some tearful times along life's ways, some joys that can't be measured. One by one, each year now gone, but still they're yours forever. Each and every memory of 60 years together. I feel so lucky to have grandparents like you and only hope to be able to share the love that you both have installed in me. Happy Diamond Anniversary. We love you. Happy, Happy anniversary. anniversary. Happy Anniversary. Pam and Dick. Happy Anniversary. Can't believe it's such a long while ago. But we've been friends for a long time. I can remember Dick walking in the pub and you said to me, I'm going to marry him. And you've been happy ever since. So, have a good day, and we will see you soon. Love, your one and only bridesmaid, Doreen. ta -ra, me -da. Happy 60th anniversary. This whole mess is your fault, Dad. You see what you've created. I think it's great. Love you all. Happy 60th. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. Where do I start? Farron, Craig, Shelley, Clay, and I are the luckiest humans on this planet to have such wonderful, loving parents as the two of you. 
I think my earliest memories were of Okinawa. Dad was in Vietnam while Mom was defending us against typhoons. All would be fine when Dad re returned to base safely. Mom calls it the best and worst of times. I do have a memory. Dad as the New Year's baby that year. I can only imagine the two of you going down our hill, test driving our new wagon on Christmas Eve. That I would have liked to have seen. I guess that's where I learned about playing hard and working hard. All kidding aside, Dad, you recently told me something or in the past. If you've lived your life without hurting people, you've lived a good life. Thank you for that. It profoundly affected me. And it will remain with me the rest of my life and to those who I choose to share it with. Through all of these years together, you've only shown love and respect for each other. The only time I was worried was recently. Mom was yelling at Dad a lot. Well, thank God Dad just needed hearing aids. And now, 60 years later, you guys make it look so easy. You have proven that love conquers all. I'm honored to be your daughter, and I'm honored to be your friend. I love the two of you with all my heart. Happy time. Love you. Hey, Aunt Pam and Uncle Richard, congratulations on such a huge anniversary milestone. Uh, I look up to you guys and I hope that my marriage can be as successful as you guys one day. Uh, one of the things that I always look forward to are the 4th of July parties every year. Uh, just getting together with so many family and friends and celebrating Uncle Richard and all the rest of the birthdays uh, that are that are near that time. Um, they're always such a great time and I will always treasure those memories and I know I haven't been in the last couple years because I'm up here in Michigan but I truly truly enjoy those parties and I can't wait to come back uh, maybe when I'm not in Michigan anymore um, and one of the lessons that I have learned is that memories are made around the dinner table we've had so many meals around that dinner table in your dining room uh, over the years and we've told so many stories and it's just always stuck with me that having dinner as a family is so important and I will always treasure those memories and I'm so sorry that I can't be there in person to celebrate with you guys tonight but um, congratulations again Sean and I send our best wishes and we love you guys and hope you have an amazing amazing time love you guys so much hi there happy anniversary I have many memories uh, of you two, but uh, they're endless. Uh, the only thing that comes to mind is uh, the trip we had to uh, Ireland and uh, we visited your two reverend uh, friends and uh, your attempt to kiss the uh, uh, Blarney Stone. Uh, it was a great trip and uh, enjoyed it very much. There's many, many more uh, memories, but uh, there are too, too many to put down. It's always an enjoyment to uh, come and uh, see you, and uh, hopefully I'll uh, be able to do it again uh, this year. I trust you'll have a uh, super uh, anniversary day, and give my love to everyone. Margaret and Derek. Hi Gaga, hi, hi Papa. Papa. Happy anniversary. We love you and are inspired by you and your love that you have shared with one another for the past 60 years and all of the love and joy that you share with everyone around you. Every memory that I have with the both of you has been nothing but fun and loving and I just makes me feel so lucky to be part of such a wonderful family. And we just want to say how thankful we are to have such great grandparents that have created these traditions over the years to keep us all together. We just want to say we love you. We love you and, and cheers, cheers to 60 years. years. That was a really long time ago. My mom and dad got married and everything was fine. Wow, that's a long time. In fact, Mac the Knife was the top 10 Billboard's rock and roll hit. Um, a Big Hunk of Love from Elvis Presley was on the charts. 
Also, this is what the trucks looked like. Kind of cool. 60 years ago, JFK and his wife was on Life Magazine. Also, 60 years ago, Alaska became a state. Um, 2.6, the world population was 2.9 billion. Um, in 1959, Pam and Dick Guest was married on February 7th. Thank you for 60 years of family and knowing how important that is, of fun at the Mustang Bar, well, no, at, at the BFF Pub. Friends, thank you for bringing us to this beautiful area so we can have a bright future in Florida. Happy anniversary. All right, back to work. Good morning. Um... I just want to uh, be in this celebration. Wish I was there tonight to celebrate with you, Pam and Dick. Um, my thoughts about y'all is always um, how your marriage has lasted so long and how you have such uh, an amazing family and the example that you have shown to everyone about what love, enduring love in a marriage is all about through good times and bad times. You have never given up. You have always stayed together and you've become stronger and stronger. Um, you've shown truly what love is all about. The real love, the love that lasts forever. Um, it's about fun and celebration and forgiveness and hope and your your example to everyone that knows you is just amazing and your family honors you because of this and um, I just wish I was there tonight to celebrate with you but I'm not and um, I just want to wish you a happy anniversary and thank you for being such a great great example in this world of what love and commitment is all about in a marriage um, congratulations happy anniversary bye i love you